on a day when you're feeling fine, when you're feeling good, how does your day go? How is that day? Like, that day is amazing. <laughs> what all happens on a day when you're feeling even okay? Good is awesome. Like even okay, fine, normal. How does that day go? Right. Neetu says, great. Purnima says, great. Neetu also says, it goes with peaceful ease, easily. Bindu says, awesome. Suma says, active and easy. Nishi says, flows with ease. Neetu says, like a spoon of ice cream. Path sent Puja says, great. Heidi says, all is in flow. Barbie says, mixed. BK says, jakas. Vinita says, awesome. Sarpinder says, amazing. And uh, Bela says, best day of my life. And I think I just want to add to that, uh, to say that somehow everything just falls into place on those days. Not, you know, That's it. it just falls into place. You know, and all of these are such important words, right? Jakas, active, smooth, easy, great. Everything just falls into place. And what happens on a day when you're not feeling so good? When you're feeling a little cranky? When your child is calling for your attention and work is calling for your attention and your husband is calling for your attention and the maid hasn't shown up? How does that day go? So Pooja says, even if things are not okay, we are okay with it. Uh, we are feeling good. That is very nice, uh, Pooja. Uh, it's a very upbeat attitude to have. Rita says depressed. Bela says feels low. Sumaga says everything goes topsy-turvy. Barbie says I feel cranky. And Satvinder says sometimes feel stressed. Purnima says eee, cranky. <laughs> I, know, I know what you're saying, Purnima. I know exactly what you're saying. Every woman knows. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Vinita says, oof, Heidi says, with the decrees, all is fine. Namrata says, very hectic and mismanaged. Bindu says, little garbar. And Kadambar says, stressed and irritated. Naya says, it's a heavy, long day. Nita says, sometimes for five minutes, I lose my control, but come back to my normal state and be sorry for those five minutes. And BK says, dukhi atma. I think because the same person who wrote Jakas, I'm looking forward to more uh, adjectives, BK, that you put down. And Nita says, then I also start using the decrees if I feel I reacted. Uh, Archana says, time will pass away is the thought. Excellent. All of these words, right, when we're not feeling so good, Dukhi Atma, which to translate actually means miserable soul, like wretched soul. The day becomes long and heavy. Mismanaged. Mismanaged means all the things that could have gotten accomplished don't get accomplished. Like the day goes haywire, right? Either way, whether you begin good, and like Pooja said, right, even if something is not good, but we are feeling good, it doesn't feel like that is so terrible. Either way, whatever you begin with, whatever you feel is the domino effect, right? So when you're feeling good, whatever is taking place, when you're feeling good, you're going to, you're going to chakas. And chakas, there's such a slang word, but it's so, it's so appropriate. It's very, it's very native to this part of India, to the West part of India. And chakas is like, oh my God, it's like chakas. You know, there's like, there's like chakas, must, must be. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and there's jhaka. Like attitude to chakas, there's like goodness to chakas, there's confidence to chakas, there's jubi hoga, dekh lenge. That, that awesomeness is part of the domino effect when you're feeling good. When you're feeling good, more gets done, things fall into place as if by magic, miracle, serendipity you have things showing up to support you. You'll have flowers showing up at your door. On that day, your husband will want to contribute in the kitchen. On that day, your child will want to do your, their homework by themselves. Like things start to happen and vice versa. Yes, 
on a day we're not feeling so great, it's like, even if it's a tiny thing, even if it's like, oh God, I just spilled some water, it becomes this big deal. Now I got to do this also. Now this has also gotten added to my day. Now I got to wipe this. And then I got so many other things to do. There's the catch match, catch match, catch match, catch match going on that. That domino effect means, and you must get this because this is going to lead to everything. That domino effect means that when you feel fine, when you feel better, you do better and you get better. And get meaning you receive. Yes? Yes? Can I extend that a little bit more? So when you feel good, then you do good and you get good. Can we all agree? Can we all agree? And can I extend that further? That when you feel great, you do great and you get great. Yes? Yes? We're all in agreement to this? Now, tell me, your best days are happening on the day you're feeling fine, good, better, great. Correct? On the days you're not, the opposite is happening. It's like things that were supposed to fall into place, parcels were supposed to come, presentation was supposed to get over, Nothing falls into place. Everything gets delayed. Everything becomes long and heavy, as somebody said. Which of these is your divinest destiny? Such a trick question. Please repeat it because I am I'm literally thinking, am I supposed to answer that or do I wait for her to say, wait for Nidhi to say what needs to be said? <laughs> You have to answer it. Which of these is your divine as destiny? All destiny is divine because there's nothing that isn't divine. This computer is divine. Nilu is divine. You are divine. Our telegram group is divine. The mystic lotus and dragonflies is divine. That mosquito is also divine. So everything is divine. But your divinest destiny, where are you going to find it? Which of these two is going to accomplish it? The, well, the feel better, be better. The feel better, do better, get better. Correct? Feel good, do good, be good, get good. Feel great, be great, do great, get great. Now, everything is related to everything. Whether it is taking place inside your house or it is, or it is taking place outside your house, Everything is related to everything. And therefore, from the feel better to the get better, what you have is your divinest destiny of, it is as simple as feel better, live better. Yes? Yes. Super. Feel good, live good. Feel great, live great. And that is your divinest destiny. Does this mean that there will never be struggle? No. Does this mean that I'll never have to go to hell again? No. Does this mean that when I pluck a rose, there will never be a thorn? No. Does this mean that that divine mosquito will never bite me again? No. <laughs> because all of these are the slight hiccups slight speed bumps that are required to show us the value of the joy, the goodness, heaven. We love heaven because we know hell. We enjoy the rainbow because there is rain. Cannot see the stars without night. So will things not go off? They will. But you remember what Pooja said? On a day where you're feeling fine, where you're feeling even neutral helps, you know, where you're feeling good, where you're feeling better, where you're feeling great, whatever shows up, it's like, it's okay. Either this too shall pass or I'm going to get on to this wave 
and I am going to ride the hell out of it. You are on top of things when you feel good, better, fine, great. Your divinest destiny has nothing to do with what you are doing, who you are with, which city you are in, the shape of your body, the size of your house. It has to do with how you feel. Will you keep this in mind, my lovies? During the call, suddenly I will ask you something and I will say, what about your divine destiny? And you have to be able to tell me this. Yes? Will you tell yes. me this? Super. Yes. Put this aside for a moment. Because there is one money truth I want to tell you. Some of you all know this. There's only one money truth. There are many secrets to money. But there is only one money truth. Neelu already gave it to you when she was chatting about it. That one money truth is money loves action. Even if what you're saying is, oh, are you saying that I have to go back to work tomorrow? Is there no solution to this now? No, you have taken action. You have come to this call. Action is action. Whether it is whether it is going to a call, whether it is going to work, whether it is going to invest your money, whether it is going to clear some blockages, action is action. The universe does not distinguish action from work, from job, from working out. When you exercise, you're working, you are taking action. Therefore, there will always be some result. All action brings money to a limit. To a limit, because at some point you're going to stop that action, right? Even if you're walking, let us say you started walking or you started going to the gym. When you go to the gym and you, you begin on the treadmill, then, you know, that hottie in the corner, you think, you know, I'm going to try some weights next time. <laughs> you try some weights the next time. And by next time, as a few times later, from there, you go on to the CrossFit, not CrossFit. You go on to the cross, cross trainer. Cross trainer. Every time you take action, there is invariably another level of the action. Even if all you're doing is walking for 10 minutes, in a week's time, you'll automatically be walking 20 minutes. Every time you upgrade an action, you upgrade your money frequencies. Because action brings you money, whether the action is for money to flow, whether it is inward or outward, whether it is for money to circulate inward, outward, inward, outward, money loves movement. Out of the trinity of the mind, body and heart, who is capable of movement? Let me see. Um, okay, okay. Uh, let me say it properly. <laughs> Who is capable of maximum movement? Well, the body, if you're looking at physical movement. Always, right? Yes. The body has the maximum ability to move. And movement means I can do things externally. Is money internal or is money external? Think. It starts internally because money is how you feel and how you breathe. So it starts internally and then manifests <laughs> externally. And Neil has been there on all my calls, <laughs> posting them in her gorgeous, stunning manner. It is both. However, do you get money inside you? No. You can create the energies, you can create the frequencies, you can create the program, but your money is received externally, right? It's money in our hands, it's money in our bank account, it's outside. For everything external, will you take external action better when you feel better or not? Yes. Right? So when I say, feel better, do better, get better, the do is also the action part of it. 
feel great, do great, be great, get great. So the first thing before I ask you, what is going on with your body and how you think about your body and how your body makes you feel, I want to let you know that, of course, even agony and pain is experienced only through the body. But when I say feel, only your body feels. Your mind cannot feel. Your heart is in your body, allowing it to feel. 